Welcome back, everybody, to day six of Christmas and Satisfactory. We're trying to get the Christmas ba warehouse all put together in time for Christmas. Let's see what we got going on today. We've got our space elevator up. Got that in last night. We'll take a look at that here in a second. Let's run over and check out the calendar. Let's go see about number six, see if we get anything cool. All right, let's see here. All right, if you're playing at home, go ahead and push pause, and I will um, reveal in just a second here. Number six took me quite a while. Uh, I mean, it was mind-boggling to me, and then I saw it, and I was like, really? It's right there. So I hope you don't have as hard of a time as I did finding it, and I'll show you here in three, two, one, number six. I was like, okay, here's one, two, three, four, five. I was like, six gotta be over here. Nope, right here. Right in the side of that present. And what did we get out of that? We got some more Christmas branches. Alright. So, tomorrow will be day seven. No clue where that one's at. Alright. So let's go up here to check out the, the space elevator. I said I was going to put a nice stairwell or a nice walkway. Don't have that opened up yet, so we're still got to get up there a couple different ways. Actually, we're going to go. I think I can get there this way. Oops. We'll take this. Take the limestone track up here. Go over here. Jump over here. Whoop. We could be able to go from the top here. There we go. We'll get that figured out here shortly. But what we want to do is check out the space elevator. It's pretty cool. It's got a nice platform for it. It's got intake on this side and intake on the other side. I don't think we have to hook anything up to it as of yet. Let's see what we got here. All right. The delivery will unlock tier 3 and tier 4. So we need to make s smart plating. And we need 50 of them. Alright, so let's go to our parts. Oops. Press M, go to parts. And smart plating. Okay, smart plating takes reinforced iron, which is iron plates and um, screws those and screws are made from bars so we'll have bars and plates being made and screws and then over here we're gonna need bars and screws which is bars again to make the rotors and then we'll take those and combine that into this to make our smart plating which I've already got done and set up so let's go over there and take a look at those machines down the midway here. Oh, present. Nice. Didn't even know it was there. Okay, there's a ladder over here. Okay, so this is our smart parts start here. We got iron being made here, iron ingots here and here. got them splitting into three constructors. These two are making iron bars and this one's making iron plates. Let's jump up there and take a look. Alright, so here's the start of this one. We got oh iron bars. Iron bars, had it backwards. And then iron plates. Now if you notice iron plates, there's not a log jam here because they go through pretty quick and then over here though we got rods going into this guy here making screws and then I have screws coming out of here going into a splitter going off into this this one here and this one here 
So the assembler is taking the iron rods and the iron screws and turning it into the rotors over here. And then the other screws are coming over to this side. And we are making with iron plates and screws. We're making reinforced iron plates. And then those guys are all coming out into this guy here. Whoops. They'll feed into here. So we get the reinforced iron plates. Which are coming out a lot faster than the rotors are. So we'll adjust that. Let me see here. I have one of these handy dandy power supplies. Crank this up a little bit. Oh wait, wrong one. Whoa. Actually, it's going to be on this side because the rotors that are taking longer. So we're going to go there. So is it the rotors that are taking longer or is it the screws? Rotors I can make four per minute. Okay, so what we want to do, actually, is put the power into the screw making machine. So we can get these going faster because that seems to be what's slowing everything down. So right now we're making 60 but went from 40 to 60. So we should see a vast improvement in the amount of time it takes because it's splitting it off. So that means it's giving 30 per a minute. And this takes 25. And this one takes 12 screws, sorry, 12 screws and 25 screws. All right, so what we need to do next is get some of these parts. So this belt's going to run all the way down here. And there, there's one part on there already. So we needed 50 of these parts to get open up the next tiers. Since we've got all our tiers done, here, run over here. Opening up the next tiers will be great for us because that will give us new products and new equipment and all sorts of new problems to deal with. All right, so uh, you can tell I've been here on the map for a while because it makes one per minute. So I've been on over an hour and a half today since I got that made. Oops. Let's go down here, go up here. I'm gonna go up here. All right. Let's get back up top. Oop, wrong way. see what this puppy does. Okay. Opens up tiers 3 and 4. Seal it. And send it. Pretty cool. Oh gosh, I need 500 of those. Okay, 500 of these. No clue what those are. Okay, these are automated wiring and versatile framework. Okay. So there's a couple of new machines we need to make. At least two more. Let's go over to our hub and see what new projects we can start. So we opened up coal production, nice, vehicle transportation, and basic steel production. Coal is a big one we're going to need. Because I have no clue where coal is at around here. So I'm going to mark that for the first thing I'm going to do this evening. Alright, what else can we go do? 
Let's see here. I'll show you. Let's go check on our Fixmas production. Been working on the skill tree. So if we go down here to Fixmas holiday event, I've opened up candy canes from the from the presents that we turned into branches yesterday. And right now we need to go check see if we got enough presents to make 10 candy canes. So we can open up candy cane and fixmas bows. Let's go check it out. Got about all our extra wire going into this guy here. And we're at four tickets so far, so that's not too bad. Oh, that thing's loud. Alright, make sure we got some power on. Alright. How's our candy cane production going? Let's get any coming out here. Oh yeah, there's one. Looking like candy canes. All right, we need a 10. We've got 13 now. Let's just go check out what we can get from the, what it opens up next in the uh, skill tree. Christmas skill tree, interesting. Get in here. Let's see. Let's see what this does for us. Candy cane decorations. Nice. New building and new parts. Okay, let's check out what those new buildings and new parts are. Let's see. So let's head in. New parts. It'll be down at the very bottom. Okay. So fix Miss Bows. Okay, a presence into bows. No problem. New building. Candy cane. So one bow and ten candy canes gives you a candy cane you can put up. Cool. Okay, so we got a couple things to make for this next. All right, let's go put these other presents away. change this up a little bit. We're going to get this guy here making I already got enough of those I think so we're going to change this over to bows get some bows going ok we got 11 it was 10 of those and one bow Oh, there's our boat. Well, all right. So I think we can open this up now. Let's see. We'll put that. There we go. That looks pretty cool. The tree. Put that up later. I figure a good spot for the tree. I was thinking right here. We'll see how it looks. Get over here real quick. Get away from that noisy piece of equipment.
Okay, so let's go see what we gotta do next. I know we need to make the rotors and all that, but let's see a couple things. So what I'm gonna be working on next is we'll get this made. And then vehicles. This will make us a uh, our tractor. And actually we've got everything to make this now too. And this will give us the recipes for steel. And we're gonna get a uh, steel foundry as well. Okay, and that's gonna take coal and iron. Well, this is gonna get interesting. These guys. All right, well, first things first, we're gonna have to get this going. Get all our piping, figure out coal, water. Oh, I got a lot of work going ahead. <laughs> All right, well, we got a lot done today. And there's one last thing I wanna do before I get going. I started, I found some of this cartrium, or cartrium, however you wanna pronounce it, however you're supposed to pronounce it. Start working on the tree for that. And I saw these, blade runners. So we're gonna go get 10 module frames. there in this one. All right. Can't wait to get this warehouse built so I don't have to do running around like this. All right, now I'm gonna go to this. I'm gonna go down to here. All right, in five minutes, we will have Blade Runners. So by the time day seven comes around, we will be able to jump twice as high and run twice as fast. It's gonna be great. It's gonna save us a lot of time. I got a bunch of presents to go get. And we will see you all tomorrow. I hope you're all getting all ready for Christmas don't have too much stress on your hands and you're able to just kick back and enjoy the holiday season and I will look forward to seeing you all on day seven until then thanks again and we'll talk to you soon ciao